Okay, the purpose of this video is to determine if it is a good idea to put a flashlight, or a torch as we call them here in Australia, anywhere near an EMF detector. Uh, the first uh, flashlight I have here is a Ultrafire Cree with a twisty uh, switch on and off. Second flashlight I have here is a um, 12 LED. Runs on one AA battery. It's called a Ghost 2, funnily enough. That seems to get quite a good response, doesn't it? And if that doesn't convince anyone, let's try a K2. Boot sequence. Now the K2 sensor is not at the front here where everyone probably expects it to be. It's actually under the switch. That's where the inductors are and the circuit board. So as you can see, holding a flashlight, turning it on and off above where the area that the sensors are produces a spike on the K2 meter up to the orange light. 